Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. For anyone that is new here, hello, my name is Jess. Thank you so much for watching and for joining. I hope you enjoy yourself here. And for all of you guys that have been here before, I love you. How are you? How's your weekend? Tell me all. Put it in the comments. Today's video is a comfy clothing haul thing. Yeah, because basically we're not leaving the house for a while and so what do I wear when I'm at home? Anything comfy. Anything comfy. And also a few kind of like comfy but still feeling like you're getting dressed in the morning outfits, but mainly comfy. Also, before we get any further into the video, you will see I have a rail. Look at it. It's so pretty. I'm so excited to actually have a rail to hang things on, to show you in these videos, rather than it just being on the floor the whole time. Sorry that I was not really filming daily last week. <laughs> I mean, I filmed two videos. But that was about it. Just found everything very overwhelming. I'm feeling much better this week. I feel like I've got a bit more of a plan in my head. Now that I know that we will be on lockdown for a couple more weeks, like I felt very trapped last week, but I'm feeling a lot better about it this week. Then this weekend, I can't explain to you. I've had the most painful period pains ever. I mean, I know this is, you know, too much information, but we're all friends here. But oh my God, I could barely move. I came off the pill a few months ago and that, you know, really helped with period pains. And then I've also had a copper coil put in. So I can't can't explain the pain. I'm also in a lot of pain today, but I thought, you know what, I have to film. So I'm in the comfiest of tracksuit bottoms. We're trying on comfy clothing, so hopefully I will remain comfy, but I might complain a bit throughout the video. Got like dungarees, tracksuit bottom sets, pajamas, all things comfy, stay at home vibes. As with all my videos, everything will be linked below. I am just under five foot seven and I'm a UK size 10, if that helps when you watch me try things on. We'll start off with a pair of dungarees because I, I want to try these on first because I'm obsessed. I have been looking for the perfect pair of dungarees for years, literally years, and I have never succeeded. There's always been something wrong with them. I still can't find a long pair of dungarees that I like, but these ones are cute and short. They remind me of something that Rachel Green would wear from Friends. They just look super comfy. If you just want to get dressed in the morning but you want to stay comfy while you're working at home or just chilling at home and perfect thing to invest in for spring and summer i'll just hit myself in the face with a hanger you're not used to using a rail these ones are a size i've given up but i will link the size below try these on for you and we'll see what they look like okay do i look super cute or do i look like a rug rat slash farmer slash giant toddler well that is a rug rat yeah i don't know i really wanted like a 90s kind of relaxed oversized big chunky dungaree vibe, but I don't know if these ones just look a bit too big. If I stand up here just to show you what they look like as an outfit, I think they're a bit big, but I'm not sure. Let me know if I need to size down in them. I actually really like them as a pair of dungarees though. I like the color, they come a bit closer. You can see they say Levi there. I would style them with this kind of t-shirt or like maybe like a big black baggy t-shirt or whatever vintage tee you have. They've got pockets. They've got a nice little button detail along the sides, back pockets as well. Little front pockets here if you, well, you can fit like a toothbrush in here, hairbrush, a stick of rock, I don't know. Um, <laughs> all very, you know, important things to carry around with you all day. Let me know what you think about these these are just super comfy to chill in next up i'm going to show you this little purple number it's a little co-ord set this was on my instagram over the weekend if you saw um, i'm obsessed with this since it arrived in the post it's from a brand called misha lounge i got this in a medium and the shorts are also in a medium i think maybe they're in a small the shorts are in a small this is so soft and it's just so cute it made me feel so happy when i was wearing it because i was like i feel all sweet and cute and not just slobbing around in like massive tracksuit bottoms i mean these purple tracksuit bottoms are pretty much worn every day they've got like ketchup on them everything and this made me feel like a little bit cuter and a bit more like, oh sweet, having a nice time in my little cohort. So I will try this on for you. I don't have a little top to wear with it, but I've got a bralette on, so should be okay. Hopefully no one will take offense to that. It's just so sweet and fluffy. Can you see the level of fluff on this, guys? This is just so cute. If I talk about them like as a cohort first, really cute, cute little outfit, super sweet, just like something a bit different. If you're feeling a bit like bored of just getting up, putting your tracksuit bottoms on, barely getting dressed, I know the feeling. So if you want something that's super comfy that you can wear all day, but like a little bit different, then this is so, so cute. I just love this as a set, but also I just love this as a cardigan. If you just wore it over like little strappy tops, basic tees, anything like that, pair of mum jeans with this like perfect little purple cardigan. So cute going into spring. It's got a very Cher vibe from Clueless. So I love this cohort and I love the cardigan on its own. Not sure I would you know style the shorts out without the cardigan but you never know crazy times we might get there so moving on obviously sticking to the comfy theme i have picked up this khaki jumpsuit now this kind of thing i'm just flashing everyone i'm so sorry i didn't think this through this khaki jumpsuit is so so cute this is from asos and the thing i love about it you feel like you're getting dressed up you feel like you're putting on a little spring outfit little summer outfit but you're basically in nice 
comfy pajama style outfit all day. So you feel that you've got your shit together, but really you're, you're lying to yourself. You're in pajamas, but this counts as real life adult clothing. It's in a size, size eight, but it looks like nice and loose and it's like a nice wide leg fit, fit. Wide leg fit, fit. Wide leg fit. Yeah, I don't need the extra fit, do I? No. Try this on, I love the color and we'll see what it looks like. I love it, I love it. There's no pockets in it, but if there's ever a time to wear an outfit with no pockets, it would be now because you're not leaving your house, so therefore you don't need to take anything with you, therefore you don't need pockets. But my natural reaction was to do this, and I was like, disappointed there isn't anything there. I'm wearing a giant baby grow, and I'm really happy about it. I absolutely love it. This is a really comfy jumpsuit. It has a bit of elastic here, so it naturally goes in at the waist. No need for a belt or anything like that. If I stand up here, show you the length of the legs. Dun, dun, dun. It's never going to be like the world's most flattering piece of clothing, but oh my god, we're here for comfort. And that is what we have achieved with this. I love the colour, I like the little tortoiseshell buttons here. But do you know what I mean? Like you just feel like you've kind of got dressed in an outfit and if you were going on your one walk a day or your walk to the shops here in the UK, that's all we're allowed to do, then you know, you, you're dressed, but you're not. Winning. Next up I have two oversized vintage t-shirts to show you because obviously if there was ever a time for a vintage tee it would be now. Big baggy t-shirt, pair of slouchy jeans, pair of leggings, pair of tracksuit bottoms, comfort but cool. It's pretty much my style. <laughs> Well, no, mine's just comfort. I picked up these two t-shirts. This one is from Reclaimed Vintage, which is a brand I'm obsessed with at the moment. And then this one is from Daisy Street, and it's like an old school vintage style New York t-shirt. Y'all know my love for New York. Don't know what this accent is, but we're gonna go with it. They're big and baggy and comfy, so yeah. I mean, I'm loving this no bra life. I can't explain to you. I haven't worn an actual proper bra. I wore one for a second on Friday, try and make myself feel a bit more human, but it didn't really work for me. And then the period pains came, and I was like, no bra, no. So big baggy t-shirts make wearing no bras even more fun, you'll feel so free. This is like a little bralette. I haven't had an underwire in there for ages. Why am I telling you all of this? No one cares about my bra. Okay, I'm gonna try these on with a pair of black mum jeans just to show you how I would style them as an outdoor outfit. And also just like, you can picture these with a pair of tractor bottoms, pair of, le ooh, pair of leggings. You know the vibe. We'll try this one first because I just love the tie-dye. Size small, so it's meant to be big and baggy and oversized. My three favorite things. Okay, this kind of looks really weird. It kind of feels like my waist is in line with the back of the sofa. And I'm just kind of like a floating <laughs> top half of my body. I really like this t-shirt. looks really cool from this side. But then also looks really cool from this side. Wow, it's like two completely <laughs> separate outfits. Wow, I could have so much fun with myself in the mirror being like, hello, how are you doing? Yeah, really good, thanks. How are you? Wow, isolation is doing wonders for my brain. Let me know what you think about this one if you like the tie-dye. I, I think actually the line is a bit harsh. Also, these are just Topshop Mum jeans. I'll link them below. Roll up the sleeves if you want to. It's like two sides of my personality. Nice and pink and bubbly. And then, you know, just black. Let's try on this cute little vintage New York t-shirt. It's got like all of the main hotspots that you should visit when you're there on the t-shirt and it just says New York City. I got this in a medium because obviously I wanted it really big and baggy to tuck into jeans. And also you could just have it loose as like a t-shirt dress with a pair of like bike, um, what are they called? Cycling shorts or just as a pajama top to wear around the house with like nice big pair of granny pants. Loving life, comfort. Love this, just so, so me. It's so me, I love New York with all my heart. So I love this t-shirt with all my heart too. So it wouldn't be a comfy haul video from me if I didn't include at least two sweatshirts. So we'll start off with number one. I'm on like a kind of like pastel-y, pink, purple-y vibe right now. This is a Nike hoodie in a size small and it looks like it's like a cool like cropped height. What? I can't speak today. If you watch my like sweatshirt jumper haul last week or so, you will have seen that I got a massive mustard Nike hoodie and it was in an extra large and I think that that was just too big. It was the only size available at the time. So I've gone down to the opposite end of the spectrum and I've got a small, but I think it's an oversized slouchy fit. It looks like it will be quite big anyway. So I'm going to try this one. I'll keep my mum jeans on for this and we'll see what this one looks like. Oh my god, it's so soft. I'm really glad I got a small because obviously it's like big and wide and it's just a really cool shape i really like this it looks cute with jeans it will look cute with leggings and stuff it's a nice cropped length massive oversized sleeves for extra comfort and warmth it's so soft i can't explain and i love like a nike nike style jumper let me know what you think about this one <laughs> I love this. Definitely going to keep this, but let me know what you think. Then sticking on sweatshirts, I've got a matching tracksuit set for you. <laughs> Could not be more excited about this. I love the orange. I'm excited just to look like a giant piece of fruit. The one thing I'm not eating at the moment. <laughs> Honestly, I can't explain how much sugar and chocolate I'm eating at the moment. Again, if you watch my sweatshirt haul, you would have seen I got a massive oversized collusion jumper. I loved the brand so much. So I ordered a little pair of, um, you know, matching tracksuits. These are unisex, so you can get like matching with your boyfriend if you want to. But, you know, I just got 
a set for me. So this is a size, they have jumpers in a medium, and I think I got a small in the tracksuit bottoms. Yes, so I can hopefully look like a cool kind of sweatshirt oversized vibe rather than just looking like Ali G or something. So before we discuss anything about this, I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused. Why is this so long? What? 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 I'm, I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm confused. I'm confused. I don't understand. I don't, I don't, I don't. So this is for like ultimate stay at home comfortness. Let me get up here and show you my full tracksuit. I look like a giant peach. I am Jess, the giant peach. Let me know what you think about this. I like the washed out color. Do you like the orange? Does it completely wash me out? They've got lots of different colors on the website, so I will link them below. But yeah, I like the li little logo here and the little logo here. So yeah, let me know what you think. The tracksuit bottoms on their own, if I just look at them as two different pieces, are really comfy. I like the waistband here. Got pockets, very nice. Big oversized sweatshirt as well, just with a pair of leggings. So as a cohort, I'm not sure. I feel like I look just ridiculous. But as individual separates, I like them. I like them. I like them. Next up, this is a piece of clothing. <laughs> This is a jumpsuit thing in this kind of like purple, well, not kind of purple, in this purple colour. But the thing about this is this is a Nike yoga thing. Suit? Can't speak. I'm so sorry. This is a Nike dry fit yoga jumpsuit thing. So if anyone is taking full advantage of doing like workout videos from home, doing some yoga, doing some Pilates, then I applaud you. You're doing everything I want to do that I'm not doing. But I really want to start doing some like exercise at home, mainly just doing some yoga or some Pilates and just, you know, finally starting something that I've always wanted to do and I never have. But I bought this because I thought if I'm doing yoga and Pilates and I don't also want to then have to get changed out of my gym wear and all of this kind of stuff, then this just looks so comfy and so fun and so easy to hang out in and just chill. I got this in a size small and it's very stretchy material. Can you see like the bounce it has? It's so bouncy. Okay, so I feel ready to start my training. Training? Practice. Practice. Not the most flattering thing in the world. Obviously it was never going to be. It's a yoga pantsuit. I love the colour. It's so comfy. If any of you guys are looking for something a bit different rather than just wearing gym leggings, you could just do this. Practice some yoga, sit and have some coffee, also be comfy, be in a pantsuit. Yeah, I really like it. I mean, I would actually wear this with a denim jacket and a pair of white trainers. I think it's really cool. Do I just look like some kind of really awful superhero, though? I like that I've still referred to myself as a superhero, even if I look awful. <laughs> positive, positive thinking. Last up, I bought a cute little pair of pyjamas, something that's super cute and springy. These are from New Look. They say babe on them. And it's gorgeous, like, grey and yellow, and then a cute little pair of yellow pyjama bottoms as well. Just something sweet, something cute to wear into spring, and just if you don't want to get out of your pyjamas all day, at least do it in like a cute little pair. And then after I've tried these on, I'm just gonna show you two little lifestyle pieces and then we're done. And I'll be in pajamas for the rest of the day. Excellent. Okay, so I love these cute little shorts. They come in a set, which I love. It means you don't have to like spend money buying the top and then the shorts. These are from New Look. These are a medium, they're a little bit big, but they have got a, no, that's just a detail. They're a little bit big, but super comfy. I hate having tight pajamas, there is nothing worse. I don't do sexy pajamas, I do like comfort. Comfort over everything. Theme of life, not just this video. You could also double this up as a little t-shirt if you wanted to. I always wear pajama tops out as t-shirts because I have no shame. Two little things I picked up from ASOS just to like, have for this you know time at home i'm getting really stressed about not having a routine so i bought myself a little pad of paper which is like a to-do list thing can you see and i really hope that my sister isn't watching this video because she will yell at me for buying another notebook item so hopefully she hasn't watched this because i'll be in trouble but look it's so cute and I'm so organized and the last thing is that since i moved into my flat i don't have any like big cups for like cups of coffee i have one actually i have a winnie the pooh one which is so cute when that's in the dishwasher i need constant supply of like massive mugs of tea and i picked up this one and it feels horrible it's like a ceramic kind of scratchy feeling which gives me goosebumps but it's just so cute it says couch caffeine and carbs which literally if this doesn't sum up my quarantine experience then I genuinely don't know what will. This will forever remind me of this period of my life, which is literally just sofa, coffee, and food. So I loved this mug, and I'll link it below. So that is everything. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and I will be posting, hopefully, daily this week. Fingers crossed. I'm sorry that last week was a bit of a 
well but we're back on it i feel I, I do feel better now and i'm just back into making videos i'm gonna start vlogging as well so hopefully that is something you guys will be interested in watching don't forget to subscribe if you want to turn on notifications so you don't miss a video and come and find me on instagram and come and say hi on my dms i've received such lovely messages from you guys so thank you so much for everyone that has messaged me already i will see you in my next video bye guys